Well, the door is always open to Ted Talbot. In episode 209, Senator Falk speaks to Ted Sr. about what he believes about Daniel's guilt and what Ted Sr. may or may not believe. In my heart of hearts, I believe Daniel Holden killed that girl. And I also have to believe, Ted, that you've at least entertained that notion. Ted Sr. is challenged throughout the series with, I want to believe in the good in Daniel, but part of him believes that he may have actually killed this girl. Don't ever contact me or my family again. This is a private matter. For Ted Sr., it's about protecting his family. And compromising Daniel would undo Janet, the person who means the most to him. I don't want to listen. Sorry, Daniel. In one of our prison flashbacks, Daniel's really closed himself off. So Charlie decides to read a letter from Amantha. He is trying to pull Daniel back into the world amongst people that care for him. I thought maybe I'd write you a letter as if you were just my brother. But you are not my brother on death row. That is not who you are, Daniel. We realized that now that Kerwin is no longer with us, Daniel needed someone to talk to at a certain intellectual, emotional, and even moral level. What are you afraid of, Daniel? You never wanted it, did you? In your heart of hearts. In episode 209, Tawny has lost this baby. That revelation brings out the absolute worst in Teddy. You can't cry for a baby, but the first mention of that bastard's name, and here come the waterworks. Tony does grieve. She just didn't grieve normally enough for Teddy and his insecurities. I can't do this anymore, Ted. I'm leaving. So much emotion and sexual tension has been building up between Tawny and Daniel. Now, there's nothing to keep them apart. 